This is the new killer. It is called Marburg uh, disease. Uh, this disease, it is a new killer called Marburg disease. That it is occur in African area, and the outbreak it is in uh, Tanzania area and uh, Equatorial Guinea. So this is the two places that it is in 2023. It is there is the outbreak. So the disease caused by African fruit bats that can cause severe hemorrhage, fever, and this one can cause damage for all human organs, and it can be fatal uh, disease. So the history of the Marburg disease, you can go to this website and you can know more about the history when started the Marburg disease and it is mostly in African area. And I will uh, put the link in the comments for the uh, websites that you can uh, identify the more about this disease. So the transmission of this disease, it is mostly from fruit bats that it is uh, eating the fruits and the fruits can be eaten by animals or by human or the direct contact from the bat to the uh, human or animal. After that, the animal who take the fruits, they can be contacted with the human and cause them to be having illness and this illness when the person is having he can be contact with any person or any object that can be transmitted to all over the uh, people who is contacted with them by blood or by body fluids so there is many precaution to be done when contacting with this uh, disease so the signs and symptoms of uh, this Marburg disease that it is affecting all body organs of the human being from the brain till the um, uh, intestine uh, liver all the the human uh, organs so we uh, in the uh, in the brain there is glial nodal encephalitis they can cause and uh, in the lungs there is um, pulmonary edema skin rashes myositis for the muscle and for the GI tract it can cause diarrhea, nausea, vomiting uh, and the kidney uh, they can be uh, tubular uh, epithelial ne uh, necrosis in the pancreas they can do inflammation uh, liver it can hepatocellular necrosis and there is lymph nodes and spleen there is necrosis uh, of the Politicals and medulla of the lymph nodes and uh, red pulp of the spleen. Uh, also, in the blood vessels, there is increased the vascular permeability, vermia, uh, fibrin, and thrombus. So, it will cause also hemorrhage for all these organs. So for the treatment for the disease, there is uh, the maintain blood uh, body balance with the fluid therapy, uh, monitor oxygen and giving the patient oxygen. Also, uh, the monitoring blood pressure, blood replacement with the clotting factors, managing complication if there is any infection. So the prevention of the Marburg disease we will see now as follows. The patient who is having the disease he must be isolated and the contacts person or the healthcare professionals they must be having full precautions with the islands, the gown, gloves. So they will prevent the contact to, with the patient because it is easily transmitted. Uh, through air, through contacts. Also, the uh, flying bat, the fruit bat, we must be avoid touching them or they're uh, going to their caves. 
so they are the source of transmission of the disease also when we told that the fruit bats they are taking the fruits or eating food and uh, like a chimpanzees or monkeys they are taking the fruits so we must prevent also contacting with the animals and prevent contact with the pa patient who is sick also the blood that it is uh, uh, from the patient we must avoid touching the blood contacts with the lens body fluids contaminated materials or the respiratory droplets even touching the areas between the patient's uh, area the surfaces also we must be avoided thank you very much and if you want to know more uh, please uh, visit my website and please put like and subscribe to have new videos thank you very much